An exclusive look at the fire at the commercial rocket factory in Burnett County last night. It caused a big scare, but fires like these are normal when it comes to launching tests. Tonight, KVU's Bryce Newberry has an exclusive look inside the facility and found out what exactly went wrong. This is the fireball that closed Highway 183 and forced evacuations in Burnett County Wednesday night. We were testing all four Reaver engines running together, and after the engines ignited, we had a fuel leak. A built-in water system quickly put out the flames. Rockets are very high energy machines and there are always surprises, so it's very normal in development to have anomalies. Firefly Aerospace is building the Alpha rocket, which they hope to launch into space in the first half of 2020. CEO Tom Markusik. When we plan our schedules, we don't plan to have everything go perfectly. Thursday, it was business as usual as rocket engine testing continued on Firefly's 200 acres in Briggs. Most folks don't realize we have a rocket factory in Burnett County. Burnett County Judge James Oakley says even though the fire wasn't expected. I don't want to downplay things too much, but I, I don't think that there's really a safety issue. The issue came from communication with first responders. So they didn't understand that there wasn't a big issue. Burnett County Sheriff Calvin Boyd tells KVU we will be working with them to come up with a plan for the future. The future for Firefly is focused on launching Alpha. One day they hope to launch communication satellites and work with NASA to go to the moon. The first time you put it all together, you don't know exactly how it's going to work together. So the testing goes on on these rural acres of Northeast Burnett County. While the stage one test wasn't fully successful, the test of the entire test stand itself and how it responded to an anomaly was completely successful. Bryce Newberry, KVU News.